Hello everyone, welcome back to CMF Phone 1 segment. Okay, so Phone 1 by CMF, let's call it that way. So nothing companies, sub brand, this is CMF and they are launching latest phone which is Phone 1. Now nothing was really popular for giving us phones at budget price segment, let's say mid range price category where you get really good specification that higher end mobile segment offered. So higher end specification at mid range price. So that's what nothing was really popular and not just that the unique looking design and the user interface itself. So all those were really like unique and people really loved them and still taking that in and using their phones so now i think uh, cmf is taking next level so what's cool and what's interesting about this let's look at in this video so first one if you just look at the phone itself the design is really unique it's looking really fresh but again the opinion will be divided since you got the metallic screws exposed and that is for a good reason actually you can change the back panels and that's what here cmf is doing customization so if you want to change the back panel so they have introduced three others other than the model that you are buying so basically four colors one is blue one is orange and one is light green and the last one black all these four colors can be swapped to your back panel again it's a separate accessory that you would have to buy it just won't come with the phone it's a really good concept but then for that to be removed you need to like unscrew and then pop up the other panel then screw it back so that is how it works and this should divide opinion and also this reminds me of the older phones back in the days plastic was the build quality and easily you could swap with different panels at the back and still use different cases as well so those days were really cool in customization but then again where many youtubers suggested that you are paying much price for the higher segment higher end mobiles but then still you are getting plastic build quality which is not acceptable at this price range again the companies changed it to glass aluminium then we had metal frames and now the nothing phone is trying really unique here they have bought the plastic back again so that you could swap it easily and they're giving it to like really premium finish build quality and all those good stuff so at this price range you couldn't just accept that but then they have done it and it looks really cool i would say not just that if you look at the back at the bottom right corner you will get even bigger screw here so you just have to unscrew and you could attach some accessories like the phone stand and you also get the phone case where you can attach and add three to four cards behind your phone so that will always be there with you you can carry it along just like the max safe that is what where they are comparing you also have this very unique looking tag which again goes back to back then we used to use those tags in order to or hold the mobile safe so you are getting that back again just the double xl size of that tag so you can wear it around and hang it on your neck so this is what you are getting with the design and build quality here as you can see and you also get the ip52 rating which is again a nice thing here it's just water splash resistant so it's not completely dust proof or anything but still at this budget price segment they are giving this so what's the budget price segment so what's the price actually for this phone so it's 16000 rupees here in india in dollars it would be like 200 to 250 us dollars so that's where this sits and interestingly they have given this mediatek dimensity 7300 so they could have opted for the 7200g which was already there but they have gone with the 7300 and it should do really well as well so performance wise it, there should not be any issue if there has to be an issue it should be with the user interface only because it's quite new here and they're still adapting and based on user feedback they're releasing the update security updates and even the user interface so nothing os 2.6 is what you are getting here that you can see in the nothing phone one nothing phone two so basically one ecosystem which is really nice so if you have any issue all the phones will be solved and that's a good thing and they have opted for 120 hertz amoled display 6.67 inches so it's really nice as well along with 2000 nits of brightness so that's the capable panel there and you will see 8-bit colors implemented there so that should not be an issue here as well so it should be really good as well in sunlight or let's say in indoor with the color accuracy and all those good things third thing battery 5000 mAh battery with 33 watts fast charger which is not included in the box again i can understand because of the price segment that they are looking here so some compromise would be made obviously and that should not be a big deal here so 33 watts is sufficient so if you've got charger worth 33 watts then you will be getting like 50 percent power in just 20 to 30 minutes so that's a good thing there and 5000 mAh should last for easily like one or two days another important thing here to talk about is the camera so 50 megapixel 
megapixel f1.8 aperture primary camera is what they've gone for there is no telephoto there is no ultra wide angle so those two may be drawbacks here but considering the price segment and what the sensor they have used so it's again depending on how they have processed the images and all with the track record that they have with the nothing phones here so they should be implemented really good as well with the video quality you will get 4k 30 frames per second since the chipset supports it so that's again a positive thing here at this price segment i don't think you have any phone giving you 4k 30 fps so good job cmf there yeah that's it so these were like really important aspects the major thing here is the design and build quality and along with that the customization thing that they're trying to offer bringing you something fresh something new to the table here and also like the display the chipset that they have used is really good so this should last long so what's your opinion on this one did you like the cmf phone one the concept the design the build quality let me know in the comment section down below if you ask me how's the cmf phone one if you're taking slight risk and you want to see something new something fresh on your hands definitely pick this nothing phone one it's available on flipkart here so it's for like 16,000 rupees 6 gb 128 gb variant but there are plenty of other brands established brands in the market at this price point they may not give you that performance but they are established and you will be quite sure of how the operating system and everything works but still slight risk new phone fresh launch fresh in the hands if that's what you are looking for definitely go ahead and check out the nothing not really nothing so cmf phone one so definitely let me in the comment section down below your thoughts on the cmf phone one so that's it in this video hit that like button share it with your friends and i will see you in the next one until then take care everyone bye bye